If there's one fighter jet that defines the Indian Air Force's strength, it's the Su-30 MKI, as almost 50% of its fighter fleet consists of this jet. This jet is the backbone of India's air power, fast, heavily armed, and battle-tested. But modern warfare is evolving, and staying ahead means upgrading. That's exactly what's happening now. India is giving its Su-30 MKI fleet a high-tech transformation, making it more powerful than ever. So, what's changing? Let's break it down. India currently operates around 260 Su-30 MKI fighters. The first batch of Su-30 MKIs was received directly from Russia, and under the agreement, Hindustan Aeronautics Limited produced over 200 jets locally in India. These jets have been the IAF's workhorses for years, but the Air Force wants to keep them combat ready till 2055. India has approved another $1.5 billion budget for its Su-30 MKI upgrade program. Alongside this, it has ordered 12 brand new Su-30 MKIs to further expand its fleet. Now let's dive into the real highlight, the upgrades. India is replacing the Su-30 older radar with the new AESA radar. This upgrade will allow the Su-30 MKI to track multiple targets at ranges of 350 to 400 kilometers, a massive leap from the previous 140 kilometers capability. It also significantly improves the detection of stealth aircraft like China's J-20, and with its resistance to jamming, gives the Indian Air Force a major edge in electronic warfare. The Su-30 MKI will be equipped with an advanced electronic warfare suite. This new system will jam enemy radars and missiles, making the Su-30 MKI harder to detect and target. It will also include missile approach, warning systems to alert pilots of incoming threats. The cockpit will feature a larger touchscreen multi-sensor fusion display for better control. It means the jet can process data from radars, infrared sensors, and satellites all at once, helping pilots react faster in combat. The upgraded Su-30 MKI will be armed with Astra Mk-2 and Astra Mk-3 air-to-air missiles, giving it deadly reach in long-range dogfights with ranges of 160 kilometers and 350 kilometers, respectively. The structure and software of the aircraft will be upgraded it will receive new mission computers and a digital flight control system. HAL will also extend the aircraft's service life by over 20 years, keeping it a frontline fighter until 2055. Despite these impressive upgrades, one important upgrade is still missing, the engine upgrade. Russia is offering the product 117S turbofan engine, which is also used by advanced jets like the Su-57, but India has not accepted it so far, likely due to its high cost of around $5 million per engine. These upgrades won't happen overnight and are expected to be completed by the early 2030s, which means the upgraded Su-30 MKI will not be available during current conflicts. However, this upgrade program could be a game-changer for the Indian Air Force in the future ensuring that the Su-30 MKI remains the backbone of Indian Air Force for the next 30 years.